Hi, boys and girls. All right, for today, we're going to be looking at Module 1, Lesson 31. Our I can statement says, I can build objects to 10. Now, let's break down our vocabulary words. I see the word build. Can you say the word build with me? Build. Now, when I build something, I usually kind of stack things or put things together. Watch me build these bricks. You see how Miss Ron stacked the bricks? Or instead of saying stack, I build. We're gonna build something where we're gonna put things together, one on top of the other. And I see three here, but that's not what our I can says we're gonna do. We're gonna build objects, which are kind of like these blocks here, but we're gonna go all the way to the number 10. Can you say 10? Awesome. I can build objects to 10. All right, so if you look at our staircase here, we've been going from the number one all the way up, 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 up to the number 10. That's right, we're going all the way to 10. Now, when you look at our blocks, boys and girls, I can see that I start all the way down here with what number? Yep, the number one. And to represent the number one, I have one, like a brick here. This is a blue brick, a little blue brick box. Every time I add one more to my brick or my box, I get a higher number. So I add one more to one, I get the number two. And I know my number is correct because I have two bricks here and the number two matches. So we've been adding one more each time. If I add one more to two, I get the number three. If I add one more to three, I get the number four. If I add one more to four, I get the number five. And we keep going and going and going. But something happens when I get past that number five and I go to number six. Hmm, let's look in this area here. What happens when I go past the number five? Yep, you're right. The color of the bricks changes. Instead of just blue bricks from one to five, because that's our first group of five, when we start our new group of five, our bricks change to the color green. Good job, boys and girls. All the way to 10. So today, we're gonna work with bracelets because you know I love bracelets. And we are gonna try to build our objects to 10. And our object is a bracelet. So let's see. The first number I'm gonna start with is one. All right, so I'm taking my one cube, my one little object, I'll say object, and I put it on my bracelet. Here goes one square, and there's a number one. Cool. All right, what number comes after one if I add one more? Yep, it's the number two. So on this bracelet, I'm gonna put two little squares on it. Let's see, one, two. Good job, boys and girls. All right, I have one here. I add one more and I got two. If I add one more to the number two to make my next bracelet, what number would I have? Hmm, let's see. One, two, you said it, three, good job. There are three objects on my bracelet. All right guys, I think you're ready to go. Let's keep going. We said one all the way to our I can statement says we're building to 10. All right, so let's see. Oh, next bracelet is ready. Let's count. One, two, three, four. Oh, there goes three, four. Awesome. I added one more to three and I got the number four. This bracelet looks cool. It has it all over the place. All right, let's add another bracelet to our chart. Here we go. Now, if I add one more to four, what number would I get? Hmm. What number would I get if I add one more to four? Oh, I know, five. Let's see, one, two, three, four, five. Good job, boys and girls. I have five objects on my bracelet, do, 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 and my number five matches. All right, we went from one all the way to five, but do we stop at five? Or did our I can statement say we need to go all the way to 10? Yep, 
You're right, we gotta go to 10. So let's keep going and add one more to our bracelet. And if I add one more object to my bracelet, let's put our bracelet down here. And let's see how many we get if we add one more to five. One, two, three, four, five, six. <gasps> If I add it one more to five, I get the number six. Good job, boys and girls. Ooh, I see something different that's happening here. Look right here. That group of five is right there because they're all the same. You told me before something happens when we go to a new group of five. Who can raise their hand and tell me what happens when we get to that new group of five? Yeah, you're right. It changes color because we're going to a bigger number and a new group of five. So our colors are going to change and it's going to change to the color green. All right, let's keep going. Add one more to six for our next bracelet and let's see what we get. One, two, three, four, five, six. Ooh, one more to six gives me seven. Good job. Ooh. These bracelets are getting, it's a lot of, I don't think we're going to fit everybody on there. And we got to get all the way to 10. Well, let's keep going and see. If I add one more to seven, what number will I get? Here's my bracelet. Let's count. One, two, three, four, five, six. Seven. Oh, what comes after seven? Hmm. Eight. You're right. The number eight. Now, this number eight bracelet looks really full. But is eight the number 10? Nope. We've got to keep going. Let's see. Can we fit all of our items on our bracelet? All right. Next bracelet. I'm going to add one more to eight. And that's going to give me what number? Let's see. Help me count. One, two. Three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Oh, wow. Now, this bracelet is super full. We are almost have two groups of five here because I have one group of five here. And I have one, two, three, four over here that are the color green. So I don't have two groups of five yet, but we're really close. We kept building and building and building, but we're not all the way to 10. Let's try again. Keep going. If I add one more to nine to make my next bracelet, what number will we have? Oh, I heard somebody say it. Let's see. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Nine, ten. We did it. We fit ten items on our bracelet. Wow, boys and girls, we fit them all on there. Now look how Miss Roan started down here at the number one, and we increased by adding one more to each bracelet. And every time we added one more, our bracelet became more fuller. See, it wasn't it was a lot of space here, but as we added one more, it started to fill up. Added another one, fill up, all the way till we got to the number 10. Awesome. Now, do you guys see two groups of five? Yep. Here's a group of five here, and here's a group of five here. Awesome sauce. Now, our I can statement said, I can build objects to 10, and that's exactly what we did. All right, boys and girls, that was your lesson for today. See you soon. Bye.